but that's from a new novel. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> How much else do you know about the novel so far? Oh, it's, I mean, about, I, I hope half it's written, but I have a feeling that that might end up being one third, you know, <laughs> because you can never judge, really. But, I mean, yeah, a lot oh, of it's still. That. <laughs> no, what? That's not one third. It's oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. But, but, I mean, I have that, yeah, I have put a lot down. You've also got a book coming out here in June, which has already been published in the UK, uh, a book of non-fiction essays about writers and their families. New Ways to Kill Your Mother. <laughs> yeah, it's called New Ways to Kill Your Mother. I mean, what I, what's really odd is, I, I wish there was a psychoanalyst here, because it was at one point called New Ways to Kill Your Father. And I, the, 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 the English publisher said to me, you know, that's what we always had done. But now it's come to this, like, what happened in the meantime? I said, oh, God, I don't know. It's sort of odd how that happened. If I could get it back, I'd probably change it back again. But that figure, I was struck just listening to that excerpt from your new novel. I mean, I was when I when the the funeral of Morris comes in, you can't the reader who's familiar with your work can't help but think of of the father figure, the, the teacher father in the Heather Blazing who dies and leaves young children. And I think it also there's also the lost father in, in other novels. I mean, that is part of your own family narrative as well, which uh, leads me to ask how, how to what extent do you find yourself tapping into? That structure um, of experience. I think what happened was, um, um, I know that Beatrice Rezzori was here last night, and um, when I went to that house first outside Florence, it was the um, spring of the year 2000, and in that I wrote the first chapter of two novels. And, um, you know, it was really hard, because I hadn't then done, and I, I thought, well, what am I going to do now? Because I could have written either of them. And I went with the Henry James novel, The Master, and this is the other one. And I partly did because I just didn't want to go there because some of the stuff in it was too personal, too close to home, and too close to the other books I've been writing. And I wasn't sure what to do with it, other than it had come very easily and almost by necessity had come, whereas the James thing was being much more sort of forced. And um, so every so often over the last, God, it's a time passing, I mean, I used to have, curly hair, um, <laughs> that, uh, that's, is, that's t nearly, well, that's 11 and a half years, 12 years? Anyway, whatever long time it is, I've been adding to it regularly, and now I'm going to finish it. And I better get it right this time, because I've been at it for all my life, you know. <laughs>